just like that, we're on to the next one. We're going to wrap this thing up on at 2-12. The, uh, the league champion, Al Dente, old Derek's team. Derek Leak. Well done, sir. Good good, uh, good season. That's also how I like my pasta, Al Dente. Right. Just so, a little uh, bit undone. Who you got for Derek? Uh, Derek's squad, squad here? Well, like you just alluded to, uh, he does have Todd Gurley, and I did take John Kelly. Um, obviously, he has Todd Gurley. He won the league. I hope you didn't trade him last year. Good job, <laughs> Al Dente. Uh, I mean, we talked a lot about John Kelly. I, I love this dude. He is... Like, whoa. Right? That's, I mean, that I is, still feel that way. Oh, yeah. Nothing. Uh, his play didn't change. Nasty running style. Just where he got drafted and, and who he's behind. Right. You know, yeah, he did. Clogged some things up. Definitely didn't forget how to play football after the after the NFL draft. I, I like this pick a lot. I mean, it's, uh, it's a gimme if you have Todd Gurley. And if you don't have Todd Gurley, uh, it's one of those, especially in a taxi squad type league where you got the bench spots. Like, I love taking a John Kelly and throwing him in a taxi squad and saying, oh, if I don't, even if I don't have Todd Gurley and waiting until, hey, you know, Gurley's got a high ankle sprain, be out four to six, yeah, plug John Kelly right into my lineup. Right. That's one of those, yeah, it's not, he's not going to be anywhere near your lineup, most likely, with all the weapons that they have. Most likely, he shouldn't be anywhere near your lineup. Maybe potentially, old uh, offensive genius over there has some has some things in his mind that he I mean, ends you'll up see being him, a, You'll see maybe, him now and again. Maybe he's a flex but, starter, but I doubt it. Nah. I mean, he'll, he'll get crazy. his chances to be on the field here and there. Right. Well, I, I, the the target share, got good pass protection. The target share that Gurley got last year and the handoff amount is, you know, like he's there's no there's no room for a second running back, and they don't they're not going to play it like that unless they say, hey, we're going to dial back Gurley and save him for the playoffs because guess what, we we're a good team now. But just just take John Kelly, stick him on your bench. Don't hope for Todd Gurley to get hurt because that would be mean. But then if it happens plug him in he's an instant starter and that's the kind of guys i like to have on my bench yeah i love this dude's running style it's so mean he he's always churning those legs he's got great lean and we talked about he's on that codeine and sprite yeah the little jolly rancher you know it's in his styrofoam but for all the lean in the cup he also has some perp in the dutch so that's probably why he fell a little <laughs> bit in this draft he what? also strong got, analogy there he also got popped for the mary's jane and uh, I assume that's what made him fall. I don't know. I, I couldn't tell you. I, I really like this kid. It was, it was a good player. He's, he's good, got all the good moves, hands. Man. He's he, got good pass protection. Great hands. Thirty-seven he hard, catches last fast. year. Smooth in the passing game. Yeah. Uh, he's, he's he presses up field. He's got strong balance. I love his situ. I love his chances in a one-on-one -on -one situation. Um, he can turn a, a loss into a short gain or a short gain into a, a bigger gain. The pass protection I mentioned is, is pretty solid. So I I like everything about this guy. He just fell and got behind a guy that, that's obviously the got best guy beast. in the league. So right. uh but I mean I'm I'm taking stabs on this guy for sure because I know that the Todd Gurley owner's gonna want him and I just want him. And if something happened to Todd Gurley, I'm super pumped. You got and a I'm starter. Right. That's the that's the thing, is that I we I liked John Kelly and most people like John Kelly pre draft, but for mo for different reasons but if you don't like him because he can catch and he's hard to tackle i don't know why you like him but the fact that he can catch and he's he skateboards hard to, right that too <laughs> he, he he's a uh, well yeah he's a good he's a cool dude but he can catch and he's hard to tackle and i'll take that in this nfl for sure and the fact that yeah he goes and plays behind Gurley, screws everything up and coming out of the draft but you know pre-draft he was being talked about up there late first early second round rookie picks Comes out, gets stuck behind an absolute monster. What can you do? He the player didn't change. Mm -hmm. You know, didn't maybe he got he got in trouble for some different things, but he didn't. You know, he didn't do anything too awful, and he doesn't have any pending suspensions or anything like that. Right. Player didn't change. There's no reason not want to not to want to have this guy on your team. I mean, he did plead guilty to a marijuana possession, but I guess that's in college. So they you need a weird guy on your team. You either got it or you don't got it. There's yeah. no. I mean, you know, if you had, you didn't. You he had a tail you don't light get a, out. You don't get and accused a stop light. to having it's the weed. worst you way. Get caught well, with it or you don't you have do it. If Robbie Anderson can't ever get caught, <laughs> yeah, he's Muhammad Ali those charges, <laughs> beating so, them up every once in a while. Prove it. Old old uh, Reuben Foster right now. He's a. Uh, he beat some weed charges and some other charges. Sure. Not the assault rifle charges, though. They found those. 
Yeah, and he's probably yeah. going to face a suspension. And I don't know. I don't know. Can the NFL suspend John Kelly? I think John Kelly college. Fine. This is this is a my, just not even on the radar. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he's getting tested. For sure, anyway, but. let's go. All right. Well, let's uh, let's go ahead and take a quick break here, and then we'll come back and we'll give you guys some uh, some some targets that we're keeping our eye out for and taking stabs on in these uh, next couple of rounds for your pleasure. 